In this video, I will show you how to set deadlines in Microsoft Project. This video was inspired by Andrew in the post shown below. Let's take a look. It is always important, of course, whenever possible, to try to make sure that your project stays dynamic, meaning fewer hard-coded dates, all the better. So we're going to explore using deadlines to show when things should be happening without actually constraining the tasks themselves. So still flexible, yet we're being notified that things are happening on time or we're, we're about to slip behind. We'll always know that. Now it's important to make sure that our project we're working with already has all the elements in place, meaning that all the effort estimates are in, that we have all the proper resources properly leveled, and we also have a realistic model of how things should go. Uh, so once you have that, we'll go ahead and add our deadlines. Now as to where you add your deadlines column, that is up to you. I tend to like to put it myself right before the predecessors. So we'll go ahead and insert a column. It's going to be our deadline. And of course, currently, I do not have any deadline set. If you did have deadline set, by the way, another way we can traditionally do that is to double click upon a task. And on the advanced tab, we have an area in the constraint to show a deadline. So this is one place I could post a deadline and I can say that I would prefer that this particular item be done by here and then click OK and it will put that deadline in place. Now that we have this wonderful column however we can now apply the deadlines in a much faster way. So not everything of course is going to need a deadline. Some of the items however will for example, the budget, we should actually have that done by the, the 12th, let's say. But we can go in and say as long as it was truly done definitely by, say, the 17th, uh, we'd be in good shape. And so we can put all of these deadlines in. Now, if we miss a deadline for whatever reason, so I'm going to go ahead and, and um, make this now oh, let's say seven eight days and we'll see that it warns me it says time out this task has gone past its deadline it doesn't stop it from doing that it doesn't tie up the the tasks and make them of course non non fluid however I was warned and so that's the beauty of a deadline it lets us know something needs to happen I'll just go ahead and undo that last change uh, but yet it doesn't constrain it. So love the deadlines. They're very wonderful to work with. And hopefully you'll be able to think of many reasons and many places that you as well can add your deadlines. Thanks again, Andrew, for inspiring this video. Check out other posts at the link below.